I'm scared, guys. I haven't played in beginner tier in like five years. Oh, that looks clean. I'm pretty sure we already knew what it looked like. <clears throat> rank battles allows you to battle against other trainers in the world to see who can reach the highest rank. No! They brought back this tiering system. All right, there's still hope. There's still hope. Hopefully you don't have to climb out of the ranks. Hopefully it's more just like elo based with labels. If beginner tier is like just no elo, that'd be great. But if you if you have to like climb all the way to master ball to then get elo, that'd be annoying. Okay, nope, nope. They just confirmed to me that it's just elo at master ball rank, which is annoying because I, I really think it could be better suited if you just have ranks and then like above Master Ball, there's champion rank, and it's like top 100. That'd be so cool. But unfortunately, no. Unfortunately, no. I just think there was a better way to organize the system. I, I just wanted it to have a good system, man. But we're back to Sword and Shield. Roxy. All right. Uh, hold on, I'm fixing my, my volume. Uh, this is pretty cool. This is a Palafin, Arcanine, King Gambit, Stuff team. It is Stuff. I haven't faced anything like this yet. Uh, but truth be told, I think a lot of this team has the potential to get annihilated by a bad Arcanine lead on their part. Or a bad lead against Arcanine on their part. But it's a little bit risky. I'm thinking I can... Ah, oh, man. I want to lead off Arcanine, but it's really risky. I think I have to. Yeah, I think I have to lead off Arcanine. We'll do Dozo Giri in the back. Alright. I understand that King Gambit gets Defiant. I'm leading despite that because we're in beginner tier, and I want to burn a Choice Banded Dragonite, because that's like... One of two items Dragonite runs, and you, you need to burn it to deal with it. Alright, I'm cool with that. Actually, that's really good. That's really good. Clear amulet on the Palafin, probably. Probably clear amulet. Also, their Arcanine's faster than me. Imagine if I was competitive. Oh, they're not clear amulet. That's even better. That's even better. Alright, they're also trapped, so if I land this Will-O-Wisp, this Palafin's just Dunyan Rings. Watch them terrify her, though. They're gonna terrify her. <laughs> I'm gonna get styled on immediately. Alright, don't miss. Don't miss, this is important. Yep, that's fine. We eat that up like Reese's Puffs. Come on, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Incredible. All right, cool. As long as they're not Lumberry, we're fine. I think they might be Choice Scarf. <clears throat> or possibly Choice Band. But that is uh, effectively neutralized for the rest of the game. <clears throat> I would assume... <clears throat> Sorry. I I'm literally so congested today. I would assume they want to flip turn. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to stay in. And go for a... Let's go for a Snarl into whatever wants to come in. Or actually, mm, I think I just want a Flare Blitz. And we'll go for a Hypnosis here. Onto Arcanine. Yep, they're gonna flip turn, I'm gonna eat that up. Does literally nothing. And that's why I Flare Blitz that slot. Because if King Gambit came in, I would have been in trouble. I kinda hope it's King Gambit, to be honest. King Gambit. King Gambit, come in. Come in, King Gambit. Amoongus? Oh, that's so good. That's so good. Amoongus is... Listen, I'm not trapped in here with Amoongus. Amoongus is trapped in here with me. What do they have? What do they have for me as soon as this Amoongus goes down? That was their Don Dozo counterplay. That's why we have the Arcanine Gothitel combo. It's stuck. It has become stuck. What do they have for a well-played Arcanine? A really uh, agile Arcanine, it would seem. Alright, uh, luckily I should be able to Flare Blitz in the Psychic to get rid of this guy now. Alright, check this out. I had to double check my Elgato's audio was correct. Just, just because sometimes it messes up. There's no delay in the audio, right? 
probably Terra Rock Amoongus, but that's still fine. Terra Fire, that's still fine. I doubled up on it. It's still going to take a lot, and they're, they might try to sleep my Arcanine, which isn't going to work for them, because I'm safety goggles. My entire game plan revolves around getting rid of this guy and then winning with my uh, Dondozo. Alright, does almost nothing. Obviously, I'm snarled down to, like, almost no special attack, but this should still do a decent amount. Nope. It's poor. Aha, okay. That's what I wanted. Alright, uh, let's go for the extreme speed into Psychic, which should do it. The Dawn Doctor does not lose to Amoongus, unless it's later on tonight when I eventually lose to an Amoongus. The Dawn Doctor has a stuffy nose. <laughs> oh, it's Wikiberry. Okay, that kind of sucks. Um, that's fine though, to be honest. That really is fine because I can actually do the funny on him now. They go for the Spore and my Gothitelle, that's completely fine by me. Let's uh let's get in Don Dozo where my where my guy is. And I think I just try to hypnosis this guy. I understand that it's not gonna work, but they shouldn't spore into Arcanine here at all. If they spore into my Dondoza, they're crazy. Alright, no burn. No burn. No burn. Watch them Terra Blast. They clear smog. That's so good. That's so good for me. Alright, um... Here, I'm gonna go back into my Arcanine. And I'm going to attempt to... Uh, I could get... I, I don't want to risk a... I don't want to risk getting burnt, but honestly, I don't know how much it matters. I think I just go for it. Earthquake shouldn't KO... Actually, Earthquake should KO Amoongus at plus two. I go for the Earthquake play. Even if I get burnt here, it's a lot of damage. And I'm, I'm like, annihilating Amoongus. And I'm going to outspeed this guy. Alright, in comes Tatsugiri, Earthquake, like, they made themselves weak to, to Earthquake. That's never a good play, in my opinion. I don't think this KO's Arcanine, since it's likely a really bulky spread. They go for Protect, that's fine. Let's see if they will o me. I almost went for Liquidation into their Arcanine, but I didn't want to risk it. That's plus two Earthquake. Oh, it looks like the health bars still aren't fixed. That's fine. Even if I'm burnt, even if I'm burnt, I'm still at like plus two almost permanently. I can spam Earthquake until I go down. Like they have very little counterplay for Dozo at this point. I just spam Earthquake. <coughs> I actually don't know if the Amoongus eats the Earthquake now. Yes, they, they, I believe they patched the RNG issue. Alright, let's see if this KO's Amoongus. Nope, okay, I'm gonna get clear smog. Dang it, I thought I was fine. I thought I was fine, I thought I was crazy. I was not, but they're not really in a great spot either. Because I still, like, they're still getting worn down. Like, Arcanine comes in and dies to Earthquake. I still, I literally keep clicking it. I literally keep clicking it. Burped on, but at what cost?
Because they're going to switch out. They're going to... I mean, what did they even go into? Oh, no. They just try to KO me. That's fine. Uh, I should KO the Amoongus here. I don't, I don't agree with them letting me go for this Amoongus KO. I think they should definitely have gone for the Regenerator play. Because when Tatsugiri comes out, like, it's, it's pretty much over. And it looks like they might be Choice Band in Palafin, judging by the uh, fact they went for close combat there. They probably thought it KO, but no, Dondoza is just too much of a beast. And I'm going to be on the field for a minute, man. I'm going to be on the field for a minute. King Gambit? I literally could not care less. I literally could not care less. I'm going to keep clicking it. I'm going to keep clicking it. Nah. Nah, nah. Not even close. Not even close. Close combat? Is that KO? Not even close. Not even close. Alright. Let's get this nasty earthquake off. It's gonna do like six to King Gambit. Alright. Go down. Alright, that's what I needed. I needed the burn to KO me there. And we're in a really good spot. Because I go into my... Oh, wait. My Gothitelle's asleep. I'm stupid. I still go into Gothitelle here. And I still click Specs Muddy Water. Uh, and I have to hope I wake up. Because I, I, I spent a turn asleep already. I go for the Fake Out into you. Uh, and I Terra my Tatsu. And start clicking Muddy Waters. Alright. Obviously, I can't Intimidate the, uh, the King Gambit here. Because it would get a Defiant Boost. But I believe they just sucker punch me. They may even double, but if I get one of these, if I if I manage to get my fake out off, I win. Nope, stay asleep. Any sucker punch? Any sucker punch? Close combat. Oh, I'm fine. They didn't double, or they didn't uh, they didn't sucker punch, so I should be fine. As long as I don't miss. Oh, I missed something. Can get. Oh, why did you have to miss the King Gambit, man? You could have missed. You could have missed something else, dude. You literally could have missed something else there. We are not having good luck right now. All right, I lost due to the miss. That really sucks. Yeah, I definitely lost due to the miss there. Cause my Arcanine took too much damage. He's gonna get a defiant boost. Dang it, man. All right, Defiant Boost right here. Um, I do have Extreme Speed, so I might be able to pull it back if I do something really cheesy. Would Muddy have killed King Gambit? It's Specs. Uh, yeah, it would have killed. It's Specs plus Terra. At the very least, it would have put it in range of like everything else. All right, here's my here's my counterplay. Right, here's here's where I go crazy and pull it back. I'm going to extreme speed, go before the sucker punch, make it fail, and then I'm going to land my hypnosis. Check this out. I'm crazy. I'm crazy. As long as he isn't e-speed, I'm good. We're good. We're good. Extreme speed, KO. We can still win this. I literally just have to like land a hypnosis, which, given my luck the rest of the match, I should be able to do it. Gothtail wakes up. Yeah. Uh, and I never click Flare Blitz now because Sucker Punch, uh, Sucker Punch fails if you go before it. So I, always, I I just have to land a Hypnosis and I'm good. And he has to go for Sucker Punch here. He doesn't go for Sucker Punch. Alright, that's fine. He might, he, he's gonna be able to burn a turn of sleep here then. Oh, he did Sucker Punch. You silly goose. Connect. Alright, he didn't burn a turn of sleep. We're in this. <laughs> he didn't burn a turn of sleep. That's what you get when you learn Pokemon mechanics. I'm crazy. Alright, obviously I just keep spamming Hypnosis in case it wakes up. I can't, you know, do anything here. Learn your Pokemon mechanics. He didn't burn a turn of sleep there is the big thing. And now he's in, uh, and now he's always in range of, like, extreme speed. Yeah. 
If he lives this, he might win, actually. Oh, please don't live. Please don't live. No, he just forfeits. Nice. Okay. All right. <laughs> Listen, that miss almost lost us the game, but we, we got it back because, because I know my Pokemon mechanics. I'm like, he's going to sucker punch. I have to extreme speed here to block it. 1,000 LP. Oh, that's cool. You get it after, like, every match? That'd be cool if you did get it after every... If you got LP after every match, that'd be heat. <laughs> Alright. I actually don't know what the Ruinous Legend music sounds like. Okay, um... The Sharp is a hot take in this format. I still always lead off Arcanine despite the uh, possibility of them leading off Bisharp because trapping in the Amoongus just wins me the game. And I do the same thing. <coughs> I need more Wawa. <laughs> No, Charizard is not legal because it's actually not in the uh, in the regional decks. Dude, King Gambit's actually such a threat. It's so bulky, dude. Did you see how well it took that Flare Blitz? Like, I know I'm at minus one, but it still ate that so well. Alright. Let's see. Oh! It's Dunyan Rings. This match has been decided. We're Dunyan Rings. We're literally Dunyan Rings here, dude. What do you think of Colossal in this format? Take it or leave it. Alright, um... I actually fake out the Palafin and attempt to sleep it. Actually, do I lose with Dondozo ever if I just, like, annihilate the Amoongus here? I don't, do I? I literally don't. Let me think, do I want to Terra Dragon at all? No, that's literally my win con. My win con is literally just, just annihilate Amoongus. Arcanine obliterate! <laughs> Arcanine obliterate! Watch how the Don Ductor upper operates this dude. Watch this. Watch how I operate. Also, was that clear uh amulet on the uh on the on the guy? Alright, check this out. No protect, no protect. No sash? No wins? No clear smog? No regenerator? No. Oh, it lived. Okay. Watch. He's gonna go for. He's gonna go for the for the thing on me. No sleep. <laughs> no sleep. Goodbye. No checks for the Don Dozer. <laughs> I'm the Don Ductor of this Don Dozer, and it's gonna Don Doze its way through this match. Alright, easy live. Check this out. Whatever's coming in, it's not gonna like this. Eshi, how you doing? It's been a minute. I will say Palafin stocks are way up. Dragonite? Sorry, buddy. It's Betty by time. Oh, I missed. That sucks. Okay, um, let me think how I operate now. I forgot, did we decide if it was clear amulet yet? I think my play here is to go for... Do I just go for it? I think I just go for it.
No, I let my Arcanine go down first, so I protect here. It's safer to let Arcanine go down, and I can attempt a Will-O-Wisp onto Dragonite. Actually, Palafin's smarter. I, I give them my Arcanine here because I need to get Dondozo on the field for free. I don't want to take too much damage to win the 2v1. It's going to be Terra Normal Choice Band, right? That's fine, we can eat it. We're fine, we're fine. I didn't mean on Arcanine, by the way. I meant on Dondozo at plus two. Jet Punch, got it. All right, um, I can ignore Palafin for the most part. I have to prioritize this Dragonite. All right. Now, I go into Tatsugiri. And we obliterate, man. We we just obliterate. I'm gonna go for my uh liquidation is my strongest move versus this guy. Because it's neutral now. I also have the wiki berry to help me beat the 2v1s easier. I got rid of the greatest check to Dondozo as well. That's not to say this isn't gonna hurt. Alright. They also may have jet punched, which would be optimal for me. All right, how much am I taking here? It's probably choice banded, right? Easy. Literally the easiest live of my life. Two shot. Two shot. Okay, we can order up next turn. Oh my god. This match is so free. This match is so free, guys. <laughs> I order up the next turn, and then I just spam Earthquake. Is there a link to the team you're using? Not yet. Not yet. The Don Doctor will not reveal his secrets. He has to crit. Alright, and this Dream Punch will probably just get me my Wiki Berry. I'm now at plus three. I'm gonna start clicking Earthquake so hard. Yeah, that's an Omni Boost. And an Attack Boost. Ice punch. Oh, he's going for the freeze. He was going for the freeze. He was like, I'm not dealing with it. I'm not dealing. I'm just, I'm not doing it. All right. And now I'm at plus three. No, this earthquake's going to hurt. This earthquake's going to hurt so bad. This is going to be the, the strongest earthquake this man's ever had to deal with. Didn't even sucker punch. He's just like, he's just accepting it. All right. Let's see. Both of them live. Check this out. Check this out. Swords Dance? Ooh. Okay, that's a little bit of a hot take, to be honest. Um, I genuinely hope he jet punch punches me here and doesn't know that I'm like Wiki Berry. Alright, live. Oh, I didn't live! No! Okay, wait, I might lose now. <laughs> I could lose now. Oh, wait, I could lose now. No! The Sucker Punch. The Sucker Punch was too good. Okay, how do I do this? I have Fake Out. We revealed it last game. I think it might have- Oh, they're definitely like Eviolite Bisharp. That's what happened there. Um... What are my odds here? I think I always have to Fake Out- I Fake Out Bisharp and hope that I outspeed. And I go for Muddy Water. No, I fake out Palafin. Because they should be going for the for the K1 Tatsugiri with Palafin. Let's see if he doubled my, my Tatsu. Oh, let's go! Okay. <laughs> We're back in this. Alright, accuracy drop. Check it out. Alright. Go for another Muddy Water. Uh, and now I go for the Hypnosis. Dream Punch, that's fine. I just have to land the Hypnosis. It's gonna be another Gothitelle sweep. Check it out, I'm gonna land it. I'm gonna land it. 
Bam. Right here. I missed. Okay, that's fine. I go for I always go for it. I literally just always go for it. Jet Punch is strong, but I'm like a super physically defensive goth. That hurts, but that's not like win. That's not like win the match hurt, you know? One special defense drop is all it takes. All right. Palafin's asleep. Check it out. Special defense drop into the win. Special defense drop into the win. Oh, I don't even need it. I don't even need it. I'll take it, but I don't even need it. Dream Punch, living. That's not saving you. That's not saving you, right? That's not saving you. That's not saving you. That's not saving you. The Don Dozer always wins. The Don Ducker always wins. Breaking news, hypnosis user cannot hit his moves. <laughs> this is false information. PC 2018. Kinda. It's pretty cool. Alright, um... This is certainly an Arcanine plus Gothitelle lead. Yeah. And then I can win with uh, Tetsugiri stuff in the back. Cool. If they even think about bringing that Amoongus, they lose. Like, on lead, if they lead off Amoongus, it's gone. It's Dungeon Rings. Just straight up Dungeon Rings right there. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, it's Dungeon Rings. Especially if the if they lead off Garchomp and it's not clear amulet. Does Flare Blitz Oko Amoongus? Sometimes. Sometimes. It depends. Uh, I like to tear a fire to guarantee it. I could also double it. Alright, there's the Amoongus lead. We win! <laughs> we did it! They let off Amoongus! So I actually, what I do here is I fake out the Sylveon in case Amoongus protects and I just go for the raw Flare Blitz. Yeah, if I tear it there, it would have gone down, but I didn't really need to, to be honest. Let's see. Who'd they spore? Arcanine? Let's go! <laughs> they spored the Arcanine! You silly goose. Okay. Uh, now check this out. Now check this one out. You ready for this? Bam. Bam. They're going to protect the Amoongus, but in case they don't, this is really good. Yeah. Alright. And now, I connect. I'm going to connect my, my Hypnosis. You're the only one going to sleep right now. Check it. 60% chance. 60% of the time, all the time. what I tell you? what I tell you? Where are your, where are your answers to this? Where are your answers? Alright, I'm fairly certain Snarl into Psychic will KO the Amoongus, so I don't even really need to... Yeah. <laughs> they were like, I have so many answers for Don Dozo, check it out, here's my Amoongus, and I'm like, thank you. I aided it. <laughs> 